Hello and welcome. My name is Naps. Welcome back to episode 20 of Subnautica. Engine powering up. Now that we have successfully explored the uh, disease research facility, we have one more order of business before we go anywhere else. And that is to find the skeleton of the Leviathan down here. Yeah, yeah. Did I already advance theories? Eggs? No, no, no. catalog of information on the organisms previously contained within the alien facility. A number of entries have been translated. Small herbivore gamma. This entry seems to reference the common peeper. Shows no immunity to infection. Death commonly occurs within four days. Shows symptom remission on exposure, exposure to enzyme 42, but symptoms quickly recur. Shows advanced learning behaviors. Shows some capacity to transmit enzymes to other specimens. Leviathan embryos. Adult specimen too large to study in containment. Egg specimens acquired from nesting site. Embryos show no sign of immunity. Death commonly occurs within three weeks. Holy shit. Small samples of eggs have been retained for continued high priority research on Leviathan hatching mechanisms. Uh, I would feel bad that they were killing babies, but uh, with a death toll of 143 billion, I think it's fairly safe to say they were desperate. Large carnivore theta. Off-site lab established to study remains shows some potential for immunity to infection, but physical remains so far proved insufficient for full reconstruction. I think that's the Gargatuan Leviathan. Identified Leviathan. This uh, Leviathan species has been assigned des designator Sea Emperor. Emperor. Uh, bone samples from emperor specimens indicate some potential for Kara immunity. Single specimen captured for study at purpose-built containment facility constructed in volcanic region at depth 1.4 kilometers. Assessment. While it is unlikely that the emperor specimen is still contained within the facility described, it may be possible to acquire further data there on the alien's attempts to develop a vaccine. Okay. I don't think it's noticed me. Is that it there? Oh. That's the way out. Eh? Stop. Stop. Oh, fuck you up. Don't even try me. Pushing me right now. The head standard. Yep. I'm sorry, what's happening right now? A head flagged emergency speed. Morning. Vessel counterfeit. Excessive noise. A fuck? A head slow. Yep. Engine. Powering down. Oh, God. I am... I'm not prepared for this shit. 
I'm not prepared. Ugh. What? Horrors. You! Yeah, you. Fuck off. and majestic. Yeah? Fuck off. Stop! Oh my god. Wait, eh? Are there two? Oh, no. Okay. Oh. Stabilizing. Can you get the fuck away from my Cyclops, please? Yeah? What? What is it doing? Not enough room. Okay. <sighs> nice. The ghost leviathan is now not on my ass dragging my ship six different ways. That makes me happy. So, we go back to our centralized chamber thing-a-thinger. Oh my god. Stop. is out of the lost river and we don't like out of the lost river we like back in the lost river There's a lost river entrance in the uh, sparse reef. Hmm. Well, this is news to me. Okay. Go 
ghosty goo. No. Oh, oh my god, leave me alone. Okay. Cool. Is this it? Yes, this is it. This is it. I found the way out. And based on what I looked up, I think that means I'm going in the general vicinity of that. Yes. That's it there. I, yes, I think that's the, um, is that the Leviathan? One of these will be the Leviathan skeleton that I'm looking for. Heckin' finally. Oh. Engine powering down. Turn off the sub when I don't need it. Okay. Yep. Okay. All right, scan this one. That's fine. Thank you. Engine powering up. Okay. There's the cove tree. And I don't want to go that way quite yet. I think I want to go up. Or. Uh, engine turn the engine off, but I don't need it. Um. Dada. Nope. Deceased. Oh, hang on. Oops. The fossilized remains of an extinct super predator. Its sheer size would have prohibited f prohibited it from entering such an enclosed space, suggesting the geography of the planet has shifted around it over time. A true apex predator. Dated at approximately 3 million years old. Ridge cage measurements suggest the creature was eel-like in structure. Calculations suggest this is only the front third of the specimen. The remains now support a vibrant microcosm of life. Note, there are a series of precise angular indentations on the rib cage, uh, suggesting a third party has taken samples from the specimen at a previous time. Cool. Uh, sea dragon skeleton, the semi-intact skeletal structure of a Leviathan-class predator. Head trauma. There is clear evidence of massive physical trauma to the head. The damage is so severe it was likely the cause of death and must have occurred somewhere nearby. Damage is consistent with a high speed collision with a solid object. So the mother died trying to get the babies back. Aww. Uh, age. Something in the environment has helped to preserve the remains, but calcium decay suggests an approximate time of death 1,000 years ago. Bone growth suggests the creature was in the egg-laying stage of its life cycle. Uh, skeletal remains of a vast predator housed within an artificial habitat. Habitat, the environment was constructed to house the specimen, suggests... Eh, the environment constructed to house the specimen suggests it was kept alive in containment for research purposes for months or even years. Organic matter indicates the habitat once supported extensive plant life, though it has since decayed. When the facility collapsed, this specimen was either left to die or killed on the spot. Evolution. While it scare shares some skeletal traits with the biter and sand shark, including its distinctive double eye sockets, this fossilized specimen is significantly larger and features unusual forearms rarely seen in aquatic species. This species has likely gone extinct in the past thousand years and its evolutionary relatives have evolved almost beyond 
recognition. Okay. So I still haven't found the sea emperor. Da uh -huh. Heck no, heck no, heck no, heck no, we're going this way. Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. Okay. Here's the head of the gargantuan leviathan. Which I've already scanned. Ugh. There's... The ghost leviathan migrated back to its original spot, found a different spot to haunt, I don't fucking know. Not for long! Warning, vessel cavitate, excessive noise. Seek fluid intake. I will. Warning, engine, overhead slow. Engine, powering down. Really? Today I learned. Powering up. Yeah. Oh my god, no. Oh my god, no. No, 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 no. Please, no. Oh my god, I found- oh. Uh. Engine powering down. Oh. Yep, no lights in here. I found this stupid thing, finally. Seek fluid intake. I will. Promise. Make you promise. Fuck off. Oh yeah. Ancient skeleton. There we go. Come on. Okay. That's it. That's all I need. Going back to the safety of my brawn. Oh, cool. I don't think it noticed me. <sighs> I am not even going to tell you how long that took. Because it was entirely too long. Alright. 
nice. Um, now. Vital signs stabilizing. Don't. I don't trust this thing. So I'm... Four are that way, and that tells me nothing. <sighs> Seek fluid intake. Vital signs stabilizing. Six meters down. I want to get back to the cove tree. Oh, I'm going in the general direction of my cameras, so that's good. We love that for me. Oh, and there's the ghosty goo. Please do not make me use another fucking decoy. Please. Ah! Seriously? Deploying the coin. Wild. Yeah, what the fuck was that? I might just have to accept that I lost all of my creature decoys. And I can only hope I have the materials I need to build more. But we're gonna get down to the cove tree before I check. Because the last thing I want right now is to get attacked by that frigging ghost leviathan again. I don't know how much of this episode I'm going to cut out, 
but uh, that Lego ghost leviathan has been after me for a good long while and I friggin hate it um, cove tree oh you are a sight for sore eyes uh, it's been it's been a heck of a day okay it's been a heck of an episode Shish. okay cove tree cove tree my beloved we're gonna stop here engine powering down what do I need? Um, copy. Um, fabricator, do I? I don't have a fabricator. Oh, crap. Gold and table coral sample. Uh, what? What are the chances that I have that? Nope. Gold, okay. Oh! Hang on! I can... Um, uh, where am I? That away. Charge my flashlight while I'm swimming. Right there is where I can find a table coral sample. Because they're everywhere here. Okay, so I can build myself a fabricator. And then maybe with a little luck, fabricate a creature decoy. I hope. Really, really, really hoping. Love the way the music suddenly cuts off. Kinda worried I'm gonna have to tangle with one of those in just a second. Really, really not wanting to do that. Table coral samples. Ah, oh, heck yes. No! 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 Okay. Charging up my flashlight. I, I do. I feel like I maybe should have saved that for later, but oh well. Charging up my habitat builder now, because I can. And then we'll see about creature decoys, because I need them. I'm not going down to the uh, sea dragon leviathan until I have decoys, because I know I'm going to need them. This is more or less non-negotiable. I went without decoys in my last playthrough, and I don't think that ended well for me. Alright. Heck yes. Welcome aboard, Captain. All the systems online. Yes, they are. No, that's okay. That is okay. Okay. And I will explain why that's okay.
That is a bladder fish. Uh, hey. Thank you. Sorry. Oh. Really? I haven't scanned the ghost ray. Stay! Thank you. Seek fluid intake. Vital signs stabilizing. Oh, that should keep me for the next little bit. Gold, we don't care. me. That's enough for one wiring kit. That's a bladder fish. Lead, we don't care. This bladder fish, on the other hand, we do care. We care very, very much. Sandstone chunk. Lead, we don't care. Is that right up here? Yes, it is. Heck yes. Silver ore. The best. Oop, bladderfish. Okay. So, I think I'm going to call this episode here. I will do a little bit of material hunting behind the scenes, and when we're well and ready, we'll go into the lava zone. So thank you everybody so much for watching, and I will see you in the next episode. Bye! That's over. Shoot. Okay. <laughs>